I graduated from Willamette with a degree in psychology. I was really, you could say I was very socially active and engaged and um, really liked the community that Willamette provided. It's a small school. I mean, to sound cliche, it's a small school with a big heart. I was involved in the Greek system. I was involved, obviously, in athletics. I had played soccer at Willamette all four years and really enjoyed my experience. Started coaching young girls teams and then uh, decided to travel to Tanzania to coach girls in East Africa. There weren't a lot of female athletic role models. And so started coaching and teaching English in a rural village. And then one thing led to another and more schools needed to be built and there was a lack of education for young girls. The studies are showing now that putting girls through secondary school has the most impact in alleviating global poverty. Putting girls through high school can really change the future and has the most impact. Willamette's motto, not unto ourselves alone are we born, very much has impacted my work uh, day in and day out. Not everyone has the opportunities. We're very, very lucky um, to live in the country that we live, to be given the opportunities that we have. Um, even from a small corner in, in Salem, Oregon, that Willamette's graduates can have far-reaching impact and can really make a difference in the future and lives of other people. Just recently, over the last couple of years, the Willamette Alumni Association has sent members of alumni to Tanzania and have worked on service projects at the Mungeri School that we've been building for the last five years um, and engaging with students. And so in, in that way, I'm learning and meeting many more alumni and they're giving back as well. So it's kind of, you know, come full circle. I think that my late grandfather, Freeman Holmer, who was a professor at Willamette, would be really proud to know that, that I was able to receive this award and be recognized by the university.